Heck is up everybody it's kb it's one bar right here if you're wondering why i sound weird why i look weird why everything is possibly out of position i am white as a ghost well i mean that's kind of normal but if you're wondering all that check out the previous episode of mass effect um get all your answers long story short a bunch of stuff broke we had a lot of issues so we're running a new setup mike does have a mic stand check out our twitter page i look like joker joker with my setup sitting here in the normandy but welcome everyone i hope you're having a great day great night whenever you are choosing to watch this thank you so so much for tuning in if you see me looking crazy up high and it looks like i'm just tweaking out on you so i've got my playing TV right here. Bat on the eyes, if we're being honest. Computer monitor is way up here. Way up there, you can't see it. Um, so all my updates are on the top of the screen. It looks cool. Or Rain played, she was streaming earlier and uh, she told me she couldn't see anything. I dig the layout though. But uh, I hope, like I said, I hope you're all having a great day. Thank you so much for tuning in. Quick reminder, no streams this weekend. Um, that's why you guys are getting a double uh, stream today from both Rain Played and I. It's our anniversary and we got family coming into town. So, they be uh, taking up our time. Um, outside of all the crazy, exciting um, breaks <laughs> that you may have missed, um, last episode, if you missed it, we got our number one bay. Uh, Tally is now officially on board. On top of that, we got a bunch of new loyalty missions. That is what we're going to be doing today. We're going to be doing people's loyalty missions. We do have a couple little uh, planets to explore. Um, I told you guys in the last uh, episode, I took about six hours of, of gaming on my own um, and, and explored the entire universe only for us to unlock um, more in the uh, last episode but uh, yeah we rescued Tally um, we did a couple of little side missions I think we did some project firewalker stuff uh, found some Perithian ruin knowledge um, and I'm trying to think what else and then we rescued a Corian. So that'll be interesting to uh, see what happens um, in that uh, scheme of things. Um, we're gonna go ahead and just get this scanning out of the way. Um, I, I, if I'm being completely honest, I, I forgot about it um, or I would have done it before the before the stream. We probably won't do too much. I'll uh, um, most likely get all this stuff off stream again but i mean if you guys can see it on the screen there we have so many resources now we've got over a hundred thousand ezo um almost a million iridium over six hundred thousand platinum um and uh almost nine hundred thousand uh palladium so we should be good on on our upgrades um tally did give us the last uh, mandatory upgrade that we needed for the normandy that's good we got the we got the shields boosted um yeah can't really think of anything else that you guys missed i'm sure i'm, I'm missing something uh here or there but once again my apologies green plate was telling me that that you know if you're playing audio uh through like your iphone speakers you probably don't notice that big of a difference um but where my headphones pick up a lot of uh, sounds, I can definitely tell the difference in quality. So for those of you that are rocking uh, some AirPods or uh, some good gaming headphones, maybe watching this through a, a good TV, my apologies again. Hopefully at some point once your boy gets a paycheck, we can uh, um, repurchase, you know, maybe like a tripod, get the mic set up again properly. Um, but that's enough. You guys don't want to see me depleting depleting every planet in the galaxy like i said it took me six hours to do my own so i will do those uh off camera and if uh for any reason i uh, come across a mission that has something important on it um, i'll save it like i did last episode 
All right, so you know we're going to take Jack. Who should we take with... Um, I was going to take Miranda, but... Uh, Brainplay was telling me on her playthrough that she took Miranda. Nothing really happened. So what about Jacob? We haven't taken Jacob, I think, since, since the opening mission. Still saving our squad points for the Inferno Grenade upgrade. Jacob will get you the uh, pool upgrade. Ooh, I, I forgot that every... Dang it, level 5 now gets one. So, heavy pull, your levitation ability to keep your targets suspended for longer. Affects all nearby targets, suspending entire groups in the air. I like that one. Let's do that one. Jack, we're gonna wait till we get you that shockwave upgrade. Alright. I forgot how much I hate this place. See the landing pad? Has to be on the roof, or the vegetation would overgrow it in a few hours. Shepard, I am picking up thermal signatures everywhere, except at your landing zone. Something's distorting the sensors. Not surprising if this was a Cerberus facility. Yeah, they build their equipment to last, assholes. It was a mistake coming back here, Shepard. You're the one that wanted to come back, Jack. Get a hold of yourself. It'll be okay. I'm fine. Okay, let's get on the ground. I like Jack's new outfit. I'm not a huge fan of the glasses. Like, same thing with Miranda. I don't really like the visor that it adds. But, uh... I do, I do think the new outfits... I guess they they were technically DLC back in the day. I do think they look pretty dope. I like them. Look around, make sure we don't miss any upgrades, anything hidden here. If we land, just tell Jack that it's, it's instantly time to leave. Like, oh, it's raining. Not a good time for this. We'll come back later. I'm assuming we're gonna run into Let's some kind of trouble. In there and plant the bomb in my cell. I want to watch this place burn. Wonder if possibly Cerberus holdouts or gotta be something that's taking over this place. And I highly doubt a Mass Effect mission would just be show up, plant a bomb, leave. I mean, I could I be wrong. Saw this room. I think they brought new kids in these containers. They what? were messed up and starving, but alive. Usually. This is unbelievable. Yeah. I mean, Jacob wasn't a huge fan. He works for Cerberus just because he thinks they get the job done, but he's not a huge fan of all their, their background. Access terminal. And now that I'm sitting so close to the screen, I don't have a excuse for... We're missing anything on you guys. Alright. Open up. Really curious to be what, what, what the enemy here is gonna be. The elusive man requested operation logs again. He's getting suspicious. When we get results, he won't care what we did. But if he knew, he won't find out. The elusive man requested operation logs mm. again. Elusive Sounds man. like this facility went rogue. You'd like to think that, wouldn't you? He didn't say what they were hiding from the elusive man. Elusive man knew of this place, but did he know what was going on? I mean, I have a feeling the elusive man's a bad guy. I mean, they're definitely going to set that up. Um, anyone that's watching this, I have I have no idea. I've never, never played the third game, so. I remember escaping to this room, fighting here. I saw sunlight through the cracks in the ceiling. Only a half-dead guard between me and freedom. He was begging for his life. I'm gonna assume that you, you killed him anyways, Jack, knowing you. Alright. Good night, princess. Hope you have a good night. This is hella flooded. Goodness gracious, I'm trying to remember where everything goes. Taking chances. I normally double check things before I click on them, but. 
will take the credits. Like I said, if you missed last episode, we, uh, I said I spent almost, uh, or just over a hundred grand. I like the sound of that. And just over a hundred grand in credits on, uh, fuel and probes getting the, uh, universe explored. Ooh, very. Thanks for the save there, Jack. Huh. This looks like an arena. That's right. They used to stage fights here. Hit me against other kids. I loved it. Only time I was ever out of my cell. What were they studying? Hell if I know. Maybe that's how they got their kicks. I never understood up. anything that happened here. How often did they do this? I was in a cell my whole life. Sometimes they took me out and made me fight. Filled me with drugs, other stuff. Time gets funny in a cell. Did other children die in these fights? I was a kid, filled with drugs. I got shocked when I hesitated. Narcotics flooded my veins when I attacked. They actually rewarded you for attacking? I still get warm feelings during a fight. What the hell was wrong with those people? I don't know. Doesn't matter now. Let's keep moving. Hell yeah. Bro, the more we hear about servers, the more more messed up they are. I mean, to be fair, with everything that we found in the first game, with all the experiments that were going on, and the captain or admiral that we helped, I'm, I'm, I'm surprised that the shepherd would even work them. I mean, I guess they did bring us back to life, but... Security officer Zimkel, Telton facility. The subjects are out of their cells. They're tearing the place up. Subject Zero is going to get loose. I need permission to terminate. I repeat, permission to terminate. All subjects besides Zero are expendable. Keep Jack alive. Understood. I'll begin the... That's not right. I broke out when my guards disappeared. I started that riot. Yeah? Things might have happened that you didn't see. The other kids attacked me. The guards attacked me. The automated systems attacked me. That doesn't leave lots of room for interpretation. Hmm. That Baron. This place is supposed to be empty. Who the fuck shot that Baron? It's a fresh kill. I passed this door real fast, see if there's anything in here. I will take Ezo. I will always take Ezo. 500 Ezo. Goodness gracious. I mean, I know we're over 100 grand, but I want to make sure that we have enough for the war assets. Third game. He was telling me to buy everything, but at the same time. Oh shit. What the heck? Why are there blood pack here? Trying to take over the base, I'm assuming, I guess. I don't know. Using it as a new base of operations. Bunch of bullets. Hey, can, Jacob, can we not put the Krogan right next to me? I would appreciate that, buddy. I'm gonna go out on a limb and say things that I don't want are Krogan. All up in my girl. There's it in like a bit of a difficulty spike, so we're not playing on normal. We are playing on veteran. It's not that big of an upgrade, but I mean these last couple of missions have been pretty dang challenging, if I'm being honest. Um, especially that one when we were rescuing Tally. This was a small facility. The other children must have died in great numbers. Even then, they were a part of the experiment. Bullshit! I had the worst of it, and I made it out alive. I'm like Jack is very. Uh, doesn't want to believe anything else. It's her side or, or no side. I mean, if you had this much messed up stuff going on with you, I would kind of understand if I'm being honest. That one. 
Ja. Oh, wrong one. I am blind. I can't see it. Where is it? Heck. Oh. Shit, we're gonna run out of time. There it is. Oh, I have to start the entire thing over. Fuck. I messed that up. That was bad. Could have been bad. Oh man, I'm struggle busting. Anymore. So strange to be back here. I feel like I'm pissed off. I'm a dangerous bitch, but then I'm a little girl again. Shit. It's complicated. Let's just go plant that bomb. It's okay, Jack. Don't you worry about it. As I was saying, I wonder how many more uh, bolus and, and blood pack we're gonna run into. Apparently, mentioned in the next battle here. I don't know how it's been with this game lately. Except with Ezo, we can we, we keep asking for Ezo. We haven't been uh, super lucky with that. Ooh. I guess running into a uh, confined room wasn't the uh, vision. Oh no, we're we're. Well, I broke the game again, guys. Yeah, I can't move. Unfortunately, I don't think we've uh, saved since we've been here. Restart. How far back is this gonna kick us? That sucks. We keep getting those bugs. How far back did it kick us? Not, not too bad, at least. We've been spotted. No shield. At least we haven't gotten any game-breaking bugs. I'll, I'll take that, and I, I, I'll, I'll definitely take that over. And deal with getting stuck in the wall a couple times. Happened to us more than I like to admit, but. Alright. That time. Not even give him an opportunity to uh, hit the wall. Make sure we don't miss anything in these bedrooms. boards, I guess. This it's a two way mirror. My cell is on the other side. I could see all the other kids out here. I screamed at them for hours, and they always ignored me. Interesting. for Jack, honestly. But I want to do a playthrough where I romance her. She seems... I must have come through here when I broke out. But I don't remember it. This is a bad place. Chill is not the right word. She's definitely not chill. Right, there's no talk to Jack thing for that one. We got the talk to Jack for the bloodstain, but not the portrait chair? Alright. Maybe on that one we will. Entry 1054, Telton facility. The latest iteration of Pergnum went poorly. 
Subjects 1, 4, and 6 died. No biotic change among the survivors. We lowered core temperatures of surviving subjects, but no biotically beneficial reactions occurred. As a side effect, all subjects died. Jesus. So we'll not try that on zero. I hope our supply of biotic potential subjects holds up. We are going through them fast. This is bullshit. They weren't experimenting on the other children for my safety. You can't help what they did to others. You don't get it, Shepard. I survived this place because I was tougher than the rest. That's who I am. You move on, harder and tougher. Now? Oh, just a research terminal, apparently. And sometimes we can't write through those things. Other times it takes us the the last second. It's all fallen to pieces. The subjects are rampaging and zero is loose. We're shutting Kelton down. What a disaster. We'll infiltrate and piggyback onto the Alliance's ascension program. Hopefully, that will give who oh, what? Zero wait! Shepard, they started up somewhere else. Ascension is an alliance program. It's a school for biotic kids. They don't torture children there. A lot of this isn't the way I remember it. There was a lot going on. I was dumb. I keep my eyes open now, and I always shoot first. We're getting close to my cell, the place I came from. Let's keep going. Sure did, Brain. I sure did. Oh, damn. Hey, Arash. It's Chira. Yeah, the intruders are here. You want them dead? We have to talk creds. You promised us lots of salvage, but this place is a waste. Fine, we'll put him down. Then I'm coming in there and we're gonna talk salvage. What are you doing here? First, we're gonna kill you. Then, we'll see. Kill them on my own. I want them. Let's switch to the sniper rifle. Dude, this freaking He's bobbing and weaving. <laughs> These guys know how to try to dodge bullets. It doesn't work, but I mean. Good effort. Dude, the Krogans get their health back really fast in this game. Trying to mix it up, use some other weapons. Now I've been using a collector rifle like crazy. But can you blame me? It is pretty awesome. Freaking Krogans, man. I'll kill him before his health comes back. I know. I want depression and I want it now. Get over here. Oh, they yeeted him. Alright, let's bring out the old gas shotgun. This thing does so much damage. I love it. I love it so much. He does a lot of damage. I can take you all. We uh went up in the air there for a second. Oh shit. Good job, Jack. Fine with you still in my kill. The room left is my old cell. Whoever Arresh is, he's in there. I want to plant the bomb there anyway. Might as well do it on his corpse. Alright, Jack. A first. Things that we need to uh, bypass.
so many cards. I wonder who this person is and why they're still here. Maybe it's an old worker. Be stationed here. That'd be my guess. Come out. We know you're here. Who are you? My name is Oresh, and you're breaking into my home. I know you, Subject Zero. So many years have passed, and I thought I was the only survivor. My name is Jack. How the hell do you know me? We all knew your face, Jack. They inflicted horrors on us so their experiments wouldn't kill you. You were the question, and I'm still looking for the answer. Looks like you're not the only one pulled back here, Jack. I tried to forget this, but a place like this, it doesn't forget you. It follows you. I hired these mercs and came back almost a solar year ago. We're rebuilding it piece by piece. Hi. I'm gonna find out what they knew, how to unlock true biotic potential in humans. I'm restarting the Telton facility. It will be beautiful. I wanted a hole in the ground. He's trying to justify what happened by using it? You'd do the same thing to new kids? Wasn't this forced on you? Some were bought from poor families on Earth or kidnapped from colonies. Most ended up here the way I did. Batarian pirates. They did such horrible things to us. They must have had good reasons. There's no reason good enough. Are you nuts? You lived it. This place was like a prison. How did you get out? We all attacked at once as they were taking us to the lab. They would have put us down. But then Jack got loose. When I came to, it was over. The guards, the scientists, and the kids were all dead. And you were gone. I stopped it. All of it. Maybe the others did have it bad, but what you're doing is just messed. Everything we went through must have been worth something! We can blow up the place, but that still leaves him. What do we do with another you? That's easy. Just leave me here. This is where I belong. Fuck that. Jack, he's trapped in his past. You need to move on from yours. He wants to restart this place. He needs to die. He's crazy, and he's never going to restart this facility. You have to let it go. Your past doesn't have to control you. Fuck! Get out of here! Go! He's not worth chasing. None of it is. You did the right thing, Jack. Maybe. This room was my whole childhood. Give me a minute to look around. Go ahead. Nothing's changed, but it's all different. Oh, we're actually gonna hear about everything? I used this table for everything. It was like my best friend. I'd crawl under it to cry. I was pathetic. Sometimes I dream that I'm back in this bed being tortured. I used to tie the sheets around my wrists and try to rip them off. I want to stop coming back here. I thought that room out there was the rest of the world. I'd pound and yell. It never did any good. Anything else? We all done? Good? See the scarring on the wall here? That's where I killed my first man. One of the guards tried to stop me. Instead, I stopped him. Okay, no more wallowing. Let's blow this place to hell. Do it. She like... When she said blow it to hell, she meant it. Damn.
Damn, damn. All right. Well, let's feed our fish Commander, you received a new message at your and go talk to Jack. Fish. Message. From Tombs. What the hell kind of game are you playing, Shepard? You did the buddy act when I had the gun on that Cerberus scientist. Telling me understood. Now I find out you're working for Cerberus. Tests were done on me that you can't even imagine. For years, Cerberus did them. They tortured me. They used me as a damn lab rat. And now you're teaming up with them like they're any other Merc band. I've got my own Merc team, Shepard. And I kill any Cerberus team I can find. If I run into you, don't expect any different. I hope I don't run into you. I saved you the last time I talked to you. I prefer I have to fight you, but... Alright, so we've learned that some of these missions count as time passing. So we have Jacob and Morton, so they're not going to talk to us till we do their loyalty. Same with Miranda. Harris might talk to us. Doubt it. As Rainplate said, we don't have boobs. So he's, he's probably not interested. The crew isn't talking, so I'm not getting my hopes up. Normally they chat some more. Shepard, I'm glad you came. Oh out. shit! I've got something. I may need your help. You remember Sidonis, the one who betrayed my team? I found a lead on him. There's a specialist on the Citadel, name's Fade. He's an expert at helping people disappear. Sidonis was seen with him. What happened? How did Sidonis betray your team? He tipped off the Mercs, told them where our base was. He drew me out with a false job, then let the Mercs hit my team. My men weren't prepared. They tried to hold them off. By the time I got back, there were only two survivors. They didn't last long. All ten of them dead. Because of him. What are you planning to do when you find him? You humans have a saying. An eye for an eye, a life for a life. He owes me ten lives, and I plan to collect. You sure that's how you want to play it? I'm sure. I don't need you to agree with me, but I'd like your help. My Where buddy Garris. I've arranged a meeting. We'll meet him in a warehouse near the Neon Markets down on Zakara Ward. Thanks, Shepard. I appreciate you taking the time to help me. You're one of my OGs. I'll always help you out, man. I don't know if I'm gonna let you. Ew. Sedonis. But, uh. I'll definitely go. And what else we got? Maybe Tally will talk to us? He's been cleaning this engine for a while, so. If Donnelly and Adams have anything to say, I'll talk to Jack. Nope, oh, they're quiet. Please, Bay. Please. Shepard, what can I do for you? Have you got time to talk? I really need to clean up this engine. Maybe later. You know. I'll let you work. Talk to you later. Cadet Kelly tells me you want the D, but then all you do is ignore me. It's kind. Of, it's kind of heartbreaking. I'm not gonna lie. Not gonna lie. A little backup save here with Jack. I needed to wipe that place off the map. You took me there to do it, and I owe you. You don't know what it's like, Shepard, to have garbage like that following you. It marks you in ways you... you don't expect. I've made a lot of hard choices, Jack. Like what to let go. Hard to walk away from it. You'd think it would get easier now that the place is a crater. But what else do I know? I never thought I'd see you show mercy. But you let a wretch live. He was trapped in the past, reliving it every day. You showed how that could be me. I'm not getting stuck like that. I'm better than him, and I'm sure as hell not carrying that crater around with me. Do you think you're different now? I know that place is gone. But I still kind of want to kill every person I see. No offense. You sure about this? I want to do whatever I can to get your head on straight. Don't get all therapist on me, Shepard. You're not the couch type. 
I hate that stuff anyway. Bullshit prison psych. <laughs> you did me a favor, and that's enough. More than I expected. I'll keep it together. All right. Now she has anything else to say. Hey. But... Tell me about you, Jack. I'm done talking. Come Figured. back later. I should go. Okay. Talk later. I don't think Joker will say anything about a loyalty mission. We can check. But I don't think he will. Been wrong about the times I thought Joker was going to talk before, so. Oh, I didn't want to go to the captain's cabin. I, I, I know. He... He thinks you're trying to romance her. You can you can talk her out of it. I've talked to her before. Say that it's not what I want, and then she gets all pissy, and then apologizes later. Hey, Commander. Glad we figured out Jack is crazy, because I was really up in the air, just hanging there. <laughs> That's it for now. I guess he See will make a later. comment. Jack is cool though. Like I said, I think I'm gonna do a playthrough on my own at some point where I do a romance there, cause she gets a she gets a pretty good glow up in the third game. All right, Cadet Kelly. How may I help you, Commander? Is there anything I need to know? No. Nothing right now. Anything else, Commander? I didn't think so. I'll be, but... I'll be here if you need anything. All right. Oh, we got. Yeah. No. Oh, I got it. I appreciate it. Let's see. So I kind of want to do the Project Overlord. I know that's DLC. Um, I don't know how long it is, but we're going a little bit longer tonight, so. Take a... Make, um, Jack to do the Project Overlord stuff. And that is way out there. Oh yeah, 100%. He also looks like the 2K players, like when they're listening to their headphones, they like tilt their head to the side, except Zephyr doesn't have any headphones on, so. <laughs> I'm not sure how long this DLC is going to be, guys. Oil. That one's kind of cool. He didn't say a word. Are you serious? Hmm. Well, I guess I'll take Jack with me just to take Jack with me, but. her loyalty thing. I'm still going to save it for the one up and we're still saving for Ali's combat drone. <laughs> so we're, we're taking the exact same team. Uh, Alright. I remember this is kind of a hard, hard DLC. thought that, that Tally might say something because VI, AI, all the stuff that went on with the Koreans, but apparently not. That's really disappointing. Really disappointing.
I will do my best. This is a secure facility. All weapons must be declared upon entry and checked with security personnel. Herberus. Be advised. This is a secure facility. All Damn, this place got super wrecked. That's super dumb, actually. I mean, get to know for anyone else that's watching this and is curious, but... Memo to all project personnel. I understand there's some concern about handling life gear. Handling life gear? Holy shit. Sounds like a recipe for disaster. The heck was that? Out. I missed that room that was on the other side. Seems like it's trying to say something. I mean, it sounds like a guest talking, but still. Bum that uh Ali or Jack doesn't say anything. Today's lunch special is Purposely. Oh shit. Well, can you charge up the, the guest shotgun? You can, holy crap. I didn't know that. I mean, it takes multiple shots, but... That's really cool. Good to know. Ouch. I'm glad that the guest shotgun still does decent enough damage to the guest. I'm just running around with a bunch of shotguns in here. Don't mind us. Got one. You tell these combat drones does not mess around. I'm gonna go. Back upstairs real fast because I saw that green door up there. I don't want to miss anything if there is something. Keep forgetting that we can just hop over the, the walls. Is this where we're supposed to be? Yeah. Say so, bunny. Oh, I thought we just listened to. Got a little, little button happy. Not seeing anything else up here. 
we just pop over this, that'd be cool. Can we throw a grenade down here? Ooh, that rocket was super close. Go here, get some health back, you, you two lovely ladies. Uh, keep shooting away. How we go from like a firefight to super nice, gentle, relaxed music. Here's the train that he was telling us about. Damn it all. He's aligning the dish to a new upload target. He'll have a clear line of sight to our satellite. This is going to be tight. Arriving at dish access. Attention. Satellite broadcast window is opening soon. All upload data must be approved by your department supervisor. This looks a little dangerous, I'm not gonna lie. It's a bad thing. I, I, I'm trying, Tally. I'm not the best shot, as we have learned. I kind of miss uh, Tally hacking all the guys, if I'm being honest. And it didn't work super well in the first one, but it was still fun when she would uh, get you some additional support. Interesting. Attention. Satellite broadcast window is opening soon. I'm trying to figure out data must be approved by your department Why my my week my uh, ear felt so weird and the freaking headphone cord was wrapped up in it. This looks bad dangerous. I don't like. I don't like at all. Oh my goodness, you were not kidding about those rockets, Rain. No, for actually time? I don't think we are. That guy got yeeted. Do not mess around. I wish there was a grenade that we can get that was great against 
I like, I like a disruptor grenade, like how we have the inferno grenade, a disruptor grenade would be cool. I mean, that might be a thing, but... <laughs> I will I will do my best not to die. If you guys could uh do something with that Geth Prime, that'd be great. Oh my goodness gracious. These Geth Primes suck, dude. So I got destroyed over there, but they might have got him. I'm being fair, I don't know what side of the room we came in on, so I don't know where we're going. Attention. Satellite broadcast window is opening soon. All upload data must be approved by your department supervisor. <laughs> I might have been having a showdown with it, but I was getting my shit kicked in by it. Those things are terrifying. I would not want to see. destroy the support struts now. They have their own capacitors. Try blowing them up. Okay. These things? Maybe? They're right on our ass. Oh, damn. Oh, goodness gracious. Oh, my goodness. Yeah, I don't feel very safe up here, if I'm being honest. Hard enough watching this. <laughs> oh, that guess got disintegrated. That like crime just shook his head at us. Okay, focus, focus on the ground. Where's that rocket? Is he at? Oh, right in front of us. Oh, many rocket troopers, goodness gracious. I saw another shield up there for some reason. Yeah, I mean, at least he's a flamethrower, so. Can't really do much to us from far away. Did his own guy just hit him? Pretty sure he did. I straight up thought we died there. You might want to move, Shepard. Good God! Over here! What the hell is going on around here? Man's reach exceeding his grasp. Come on. I'll explain. Is that it? Oh, multiple missions in this. I was super confused. Probably not much. This isn't over yet. I was gonna say she sounds super pissed. Who did you say you were? Dr. Gavin Archer, 
chief scientist at this facility, and probably the only one left. You owe us that explanation. This is Project Overlord, an attempt to gain influence over the Geth by interfacing a human mind with a VI. The results have been... I'm so surprised Tally doesn't have anything to say. I'd hate to see what you'd call a disaster. You can't dismiss the entire project. We did succeed, at least partially. My brother, David, volunteered to serve as a test subject, but his mind couldn't handle the VI connection. He's like a virus now, infecting our networks and seizing control of any technology he finds. It's why you had to destroy the dish. Imagine if his program got off-world. How does he take control of electronics? This is a hybrid intelligence the likes of which I've never seen. I don't know where the man ends and the machine begins. What's the worst case scenario? A technological apocalypse. Every machine, every weapon, every computer could be turned against us. If he hit the extranet, who knows where it would end. You should have considered that before you started the experiment. We couldn't be expected to account for every outcome. Certainly not the abomination, David. Why do you keep looking at Tally? David, the VI has fortified itself in the main laboratory at Atlas Station. It's in lockdown now. Oh, well, it sounds like that's where we're headed. To enter, you need to manually override security from our facilities in the Prometheus and Vulcan stations. How does the lockdown work? It's a fail-safe procedure in the event of an emergency. Normally, all three project leads have to agree to cancel the lockdown. I'm the only one left now. I can give my authorization, but you'll have to manually reset the other two yourself. What happens if I have to kill your brother? Let's just hope it doesn't come to that. Tell me about the Vulcan and Prometheus stations. Vulcan Station is our geothermal plant. It generates power for the four outposts. Prometheus Station is a crashed Geth ship full of dormant machines. We use them for our experiments. What happens on this station? This is Hermes Station, our communications uplink with the wider galaxy. If you hadn't destroyed the dish in time, the outcome would have been catastrophic. What went wrong with the experiment? David volunteered to interface with the VI to give it genuine consciousness. Theoretically, it should have been safe, but with artificial intelligence, there's no such thing as safe. Then you shouldn't have attempted it. And what if you've never attempted to find the Reapers, Commander Shepard? Where would the galaxy be then? Sometimes you have to ignore the risks. What can you tell me about Atlas Station? Atlas Station is the main laboratory where all of our VI experiments take place. It's your final goal once you've overridden the lockdown. It's also where my brother became something else. Tell me more about Project Overlord. We wanted to turn the Geth's religious impulse into a weapon. When we saw them following Saren, we realized they could be swayed. And if a proper figurehead was created, a virus with a face, if you will, the Geth might be controlled. Reverse of you. That's an ambitious undertaking. It would be the perfect weapon. Victory without casualties. We could avoid war with the Geth altogether. That was the plan, anyway. I'm heading out now. The other stations are all within driving distance. Best of luck, Commander. Thanks. I guess. Level up, it says. Right. Colonel Grenade. Here we go. Heavy Inferno Grenade, the advanced plasma burns at higher temperatures and does more damage. Flash zone and the number of fragments of this grid is increased and allowing you to score more targets. I'm gonna go with the uh, better damage. Oh, but I didn't get any points, that's lame. Uh, the way that the level up in this game works, man. I don't know about it sometimes. No, I keep complaining. <laughs> We're getting in this. Apparently so.
override the lockdown from each facility. Doesn't matter which one you hit first, but you can't enter Atlas Station until you've dealt with both. Also, keep an eye out for Cerberus security mechs. The VI has likely taken control of them. Archer out. I guess we'll go to Vulcan first, because that's the one that's popped up on the map. That looks dangerous. It is pretty. Looks looks great. Some dinosaurs way out there. I don't think we can hit him. It'd be funny if we could, but close. I'm mean, super bummed. There's no companion dialogue. Keep seeing the mecha name pop up, so I'm assuming we're gonna have company here pretty soon, but fifty cows, shady cows make their return. Pick this up. An emergency Cerberus data packet has been recovered. It contains information on Project Overlord that other research cells need to review. Oh, Be well. for more packets in the area. Five more remain. Apparently, that's an extra thing that we have to do now. the same crew. Oh, damn. <laughs> Too bad we can't do that to all the mechs. like Mustafar. This one may be a little more so. Scanning area. Analysis. Vending stations provide adequate velocity to enhance vehicle lift. Alright. Interestingly enough, I guess. Sometimes, like, our, our rockets lock on, and other times, they don't. I don't know which way we're supposed to go, but... Iridium. This doesn't look dangerous at all. Lava. Frogger. I imagine it is hot as hell on that hammerhead.
I have to get out and do something I'm assuming. Yep. One of these days, I just want like a super simple mission. Just show up and press a button, walk out. What the heck? Get the next legs out. Okay, where they crawl at you? Good to know. I've ever paid that much attention. I'm okay. No. Maybe like an area we could possibly climb into. Assuming that didn't go to plan. These ones are not as close together as normal. to talk to us. I don't know. I mean, it could just be trying to kill us, but... I thought my baby had fallen asleep, but... Apparently not. Is an angry baby. Come on, come on. Hopefully, those little research nodes aren't that hard to find when we get back to the other of the world, whatever it is. I'd like to find everything. I don't know if it's like an achievement or if it actually does anything for us, but I hate to leave something not completed. The way this thing like plops down is not the most oh shit. Not paying attention. Almost got us killed. Yeah, she doesn't sound happy. Wait, is this rock disappearing into the lava? It is. Alright. Good to know I guess. Not sure if it's gonna make us drive back through all of this, but feels like there might be something extra up here. Not so. Probably nothing important, but. Oh my goodness. I have not saved since we've been here. Alright. Save before we drive up into the carry carry part. Of this thing does not take much to blow up, if we're being honest. I 
Like it does a decent amount of damage, I guess. But at least with the Mako, you could, you could take a few shots. This thing, not a chance. I figured it did. They hard to find rain, I'm assuming that uh you found them all. Still can't save them because shit, I forgot about that. Damn it. Is there any way to like repair the vehicle or is it just don't take damage for a while? Come on, come on. Hey, they go offline. I feel like this is a trap because I didn't kill them both. Alright, I'll take it, I guess. What's this for? Anything up here? Yes? Thanks, Rain. Like I said, I didn't really do any of the uh, Project Firewalker stuff, so I never really flew this. I feel like I've done this DLC before, but I also don't remember it, so... It looks like we're... Riding the lava rocks up. It's over, Anakin. I have the high ground. Be another one that we have to get out. Nobody left but us. All right, Jack. Thanks for that uh, good bit of information. I guess. Save now that we're uh, off of it. Right? Makes comments any other time, but... I was just shooting the blow with these stuff. I didn't know that was actually what we were supposed to do. Mics aren't that bad. It's easier than the Geth, if we're being honest. I'll take mechs over Geth any day. Unless it's the heavy mechs, then probably not. Just kidding. Good god. That thing did not mess around. I'll take it back. I'm sorry. We're underestimating you. Ultrons freaking rip through your shields like it's nobody's business. Ah, one down. Alright. Good? Everything everything Gucci? Alright there, Jack? This maybe seems safe. Uh, 
don't know if there's anything extra to find in here, but... Another research lab. I don't know if like that VI is just kicking in because it doesn't like that we're here or, or what. I was say there's got to be more in here. Hey, lookers. Oh shit. Not what I wanted to see. No, I, I said I don't remember this one very well. Like, I haven't played the Project Firewalker DLC. I'm pretty sure I played this one, but I, I don't remember it very well. You gotta remember that. Um, I've only played ME2 to completion once. Well, else is still shooting at us on another turn. Goodness gracious. Is this where we get David? And, yeah. Oh yeah, he already said it was David. Yeah, 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 yeah. I like remember bits and pieces. I don't remember all of it. You remember little, little parts. Pretty sure this is this is all messed up once we finish it. What the heck? Doesn't want us to shoot. Like put its hands up and everything. Are you receiving this? Come on, Shepard. This is Doctor Archer. Please respond. I hear you, Doctor. We've hit the override at Falcon Station and are moving on. Oh damn! Who did that? Oh, Jack. Shepard out. I was like, I didn't hit the button. <laughs> Alright, so Vocal Station's down. little reverse tidbit so we can get the achievement because I'm assuming once we finish this mission
So we have a cat named Jack. I read that as in Jack the Companion. Thing down here. Nope. Got it. Hammerhead. Then no. Ooh. All that. A big mech. Alright, it's our second bit of, uh, out of packet. I hope these things aren't that hard to find. You know me, guys, I'm all about the achievements. Everything is. I'm assuming they're fairly spread out. That looks like where we're supposed to go. I won't spend too long looking for all of these, but I definitely want to try to find them. I feel like they're gonna be annoying, Rain. Only got two. Trying to like stay kind of high. Feel like we might be able to see them if we're up high, but maybe back here was not where we're supposed to go. If I can remember, I'll put a timestamp on YouTube so you guys can skip over this. There's one. Halfway there. Another Cerberus data packet has been recovered. Three more remain. I'm gonna assume that there's maybe one up by the Prometheus Station. Threat detection. Enemy units nearby. I mean, threat detected. Normally, those are around. Oop. We're, in. We're gonna blow up. We're gonna blow up. We're gonna blow up. I thought we were dead. Let's sit right behind this. Blow up the turret. That works. There's one. That's four. Two more remain. So if I was a game developer, I'd put one over by the Prometheus station, and one over by the final station that we have to go to. I don't know if I'm right in that assumption, Rain, but that's what I would guess. If anyone in the chat knows, let me know so I'm not driving around like crazy looking for these things. Scans indicate VI infection is present. Oh, nope, there's one right there. Oh, we're on fire again.
Okay, fine, Rain. This one is most. Er, oh, fuck. Uh, oh my gosh. can't save in this thing. So dumb. Of course, gonna make us find out all these again. Knowing one bar, knowing myself. Find a giant tree? Okay. So dumb. But knowing me, I'm not going to be able to find ones that I found previously. That's normally how things work when I'm playing games. I don't know if there's anything back in here, but I'm going to check. There's one. I don't know if we came back here before. Hostile Dude, this hammerhead is so fragile. I wish we could upgrade the hammerhead. That would that would make me happy. Well, I don't think we found this one previously. Another Cerberus data packet has been recovered. Three more remain. I'm trying to remember where I found them all. One over there, one over there. Got it. Thanks, Rain. Have to remember where I found the other the other three. But Rainplate said the magic word. She said you get an achievement if you find them all. So a turret's not gonna spawn. All right. I'm not gonna complain in the slightest. That is a okay with me. I think we already did the one back there, but I can check. Threat detection. Enemy units nearby. Uh, what the fuck was that? I don't know if anyone watching this is the same way, but like... Uh, Rainplay Tonight streaming room is in a completely separate part of the house. By yourself. What the fuck? I feel like we're gonna be extra toasty in there. And if something gets like knocked over or <laughs> makes a noise, get a little freaked out, not gonna lie. Alright, just one more. I think the one around the corner here is where we we died last. Yeah, up here. Ooh. Switching through the map. That would suck to have to 
restart this again, I, I would probably just give up. I, I honestly don't think I would keep doing it. One down. Alright, I think we got it. Heck. Well, we killed that turret already, but... Oh, thank God. We did it. Nice, we got them all. Alright, to Prometheus Station. I left out we said we were going to do a bunch of loyalty missions, and we've done Jack's. And a mission that I thought Jack and Tally would have a lot to say on, but... One bar. Don't break the game, buddy. Alright, let's see if Prometheus is as crazy as, uh... achievement to pop up maybe it's afterwards frame oh they said this is the right guest ship this is gonna suck it's gonna be a bunch of guests awesome super awesome Missing three squad mates. Yep, found all six. Not good. Good God. The Willikers. This is fucking terrifying. <laughs> I don't like. Warning, we are being targeted. Ooh, Lordy. Warning, Gift Cannon is locking on our location. Bruh. I mean, at least it destroyed the freaking pillar for us, but. I'm assuming if we get hit by that thing, it's game over. Jesus. Don't stop moving. Don't let that thing lock onto you. Holy crap. That was super scary. We got him. Attention visitors. This server's facility contains hazardous AI technology. You agree to assume all liability for personal injuries or death. 
<laughs> uh, you might die. But, uh, enjoy your stay. What the fuck? My achievement's bugged? Of course it is. Why wouldn't it be? Oh, rain. Rain, 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 rain. And like, why... Why didn't they add companion dialogue? Hearing Tally say stuff there and all this would be... Super interesting. I'm sure she would have a lot to say. Place suck too, buddy. Jeez. What's going on here? You're fine, Rain. I'm sure we'll get some special email if we'll find them all. The AI just closed that door. I feel like he did. I also fail. Like, I guess I'm gonna wake up at some point. <laughs> and he keeps closing the doors on us. Halloween was yesterday. Flanagan ran around wearing spare gift parts. Spooked the shit out of everyone. Now I definitely hate him. they would take so much stuff out. Makes completing it less cool, in my opinion. It sounds super spooky in here. But this looks like a firefight coming in soon. It's gotta be, right? Like I said, make it stop. Sounds like... <laughs> to all Cerberus personnel, in an effort to reduce workplace stress, music has oh been my gosh. for station-wide broadcast. Great music. This, this is... This is, a. Uh, Damn pancakes. Scanning area. Analysis. The objective is located on the far side of this impasse. What, what does this do here? What are we gonna do? Up. Oh. To the right. 
how do I, how do, I do this? I go. Go to the right. Move up. Move up. Move up. And all I needed? Assuming? Yeah, but now I can't get any of that stuff. Okay, I see what they're trying to do. I could just go straight across like that. That would be way too easy, right? 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 I just move that one over. Go this. That one down. That one over. Now we should be able to reach everything, right? Then we can go get all the actual story stuff. You know me, gotta get everything even if it doesn't do anything for us. A whopping 600 credits. That was that was so worth it. Oh, pancakes. I could go for some waffles. At least that was a super simple puzzle. One of those ones where we're moving things around like crazy. I feel like as soon as we activate this, or do this, it's gonna activate all the gas. It's just my guess. Oh, wrong one. Oh, did you not go do that stuff? Yeah, it wasn't worth it. I thought maybe it'd be some cool story information on this DLC, but of course not. That's smart, though. <laughs> Knew that was coming. Yep, yep, of course, of course, of course. And there's the catch. <laughs> I knew this was too easy. Yeah, me too, Shep. Me too. Come on, let's move. Hostile gas activity detected. Armed response is authorized. Get every freaking gas on the ship. It's gonna be. It's not ideal. Definitely not ideal. I'm, I'm, I'm super bummed they didn't add any. I know I keep saying it, but it would be such a good mission for, for additional dialogue from, from Jack and Tally. I, I don't get why they wouldn't. You hate to see it, you hate to see it, you hate to see it. Get punched. Kinda lost. Kinda lost. These fucking hunters. Yeah, yeah, just get back up. Not an issue. Fire. 
this freaking like program AI dip control whatever it is is ridiculous Bruh. ridiculous where am I going They were like actually invisible, invisible. It wasn't like that halo. I can still kind of see him. That would be awful. It's not good. Oh my goodness. Oh goodness. Stay down. What the fuck? I thought it was dead. I thought it was dead. Oh my gosh. Well, Tally, don't don't jump in front of me. This thing dead. A whole lot farther back than I remember. I don't have to remember having to walk through this much when we were trying to escape. Holy crap! That rocket just went through our hair. There's too much going on right now. Oh, you guys stay down there, please. Asking you nicely. Please, please stay back. Just stay back there, sir. Who are you? Who are you shooting at? Oh, going right in front of me. You're just going through all our ammo, holy crap. Jeez. That was ridiculous. DLC is a uh, lot longer than I thought it was going to be, if I'm being honest. I thought it would be like another in and out one. I 
been kind of crazy. Oh. This is it, apparently. We were here. Earlier. Bruh. Dude, that dude is super messed up. Super duper messed up. Everything's just. It said no to the. Whatever that room is. This is weird. This is super weird. Does some uh, pretty weird stuff if we're being honest. Arriving at level two. Arriving at level four. Arriving at level six. System malfunction. Stairs. Arriving at level two. Arriving at level four. Arriving at level six. System malfunction. There's something I have to do here, I'm assuming. So confused. Arriving at level three. Arriving at level five. Arriving at level seven. There we go. Oh, that looks bad. Oh, that's super bad. Oh, super bad, super bad, super bad, super bad, super bad. Oh my goodness gracious. Well, but you guys have fun down there. We still have our...
He went from what I thought was helping us to uh, trying to kill us really fast. Gonna die. Trouble behind. They're all yours to take up. This should come in handy. Oh, nice. Decelerator offline. Serious injury may occur. I'm sure. Got all the weird stuff around it. What the heck? This is super confusing. Get ready. I wouldn't be surprised if this button summoned a ring. <laughs> We like being through the eyes of the the VR right now. I'm assuming. Oh shit! Here, gotta be careful. We take all our damage in here. whatever in here is, but... Super trippy. My, uh... I'm gonna take all these guys out. <laughs> oh shit, we're about to die. See anything else over here? David, I want you to order the Geth to take a step forward. How does he do it? David is a mathematical savant. 
His autistic mind can interpret the Geth language at its most basic form and mimic their fanatics. With his photographic memory, cross-referencing the meaning as a snap, he's literally a human computer. And you think he can interface with the Geth's neural network? I do. Is that even safe, Doctor? I see no harm in finding out. <laughs> I'm gonna say that there was a uh, a lot of her. Square root of 906.01 is 30.1. Square root of 912.04 is 30.2. David, can you repeat my notes from Thursday's experiment? Square root of 918.09 is 30.3. David, please pay attention. Loud. It's getting loud in here. I'm sorry. You didn't deserve that. Would you mind repeating my notes? Thursday's experiment. Log 137.3. The experiment yielded no discernible patterns of geth obedience. End dictation now, David. Hell, the elusive man will have my head for this. Thank you. And how are you feeling today? Square root of 924.16 is 30.4. Earplugs will be good. <laughs> Blake. Like, super deep, man. This is the way we just came, isn't it? I don't quite know which way we're supposed to be going. Like this opened up back here, okay. So sad. Gracious. This place is such a mind trip. Warning. Elevator exceeds maximum weight capacity. Don't like the sound of that. Don't like the sound of that at all. goodness doing this by ourselves oh dear god purple beans where is that it does a lot of damage i will take it Assuming guests are going to start showing up at some point. Where's it coming from? Oh 
don't know where the thing is. There it is. There's one. Two. David? Where they coming from? Uh, switch weapons, switch weapons. Oh man, I really wish we had companions. Dude, you can see him in there, that's so messed up. Dude, that's so messed up. Quiet. Please make it stop. Wait! Commander! Dude, how could you do this I'm to your thinking. own brother? Don't do anything rash. Rash? Like forcing your own brother into an experiment? I know how this must look, but I never intended any harm to come to him. You must believe me. It's not like I planned this. It was an accident. Seeing David communicate with the Geth, it all seemed harmless. And before you knew it, you were running your own private hell. I had no choice. The demands were incredible. The elusive man doesn't broker failure. Any war we fight with the Geth will be bloody. I was asked to find a way to avoid that. And how many have already died for this project? More souls than will ever forgive me. But I won't apologize for radical ideas. If my work spares a million mothers mourning the loss of a million sons, my conscience will rest easy. Look at him. Your brother will never be the same. The damage may not be permanent. But he's crying. This is so messed up. Some semblance of his mind. Some semblance? Dude, get, listen to yourself. Cerberus will never leave him alone. Your brother will always be a lab rat. Been a well cared for lab rat. At least he'd still be alive. So you'll sacrifice your brother's happiness for your own ambition. Super messed up. I've seen enough of your cruelty to know he'll never be free from it here. I'm taking him away. No, leave him! He's too valuable! <laughs> you even think about coming after your brother and this bullet will be waiting for you. Then we'll see who's valuable. Where will you take him? I'm not fucking telling you. Grissom Academy. Oh. They can help special cases like David. Apparently Mine we are. Torture. Joker, contact the Academy and let them know we've got someone who needs their help. Aye, aye, Commander. 
The elusive man can fire me if he doesn't like it. Square root of 912.04 is 30.2. It all seemed hard. Square root of 912.04 is 30.2. That mission was an absolute gut punch. Holy crap. The elusive man wishes to speak to you in a deep briefing room, Commander. You're ridiculous. I feel so bad for you. Oh man, that that sucked. Sucked a lot. I'm gonna go get yelled at now. The elusive man wishes to speak. Yeah, of course he does. All the biotic. What do we need for the shield damage protection. Anyone could uh, leave. The elusive man wishes to speak to you in the briefing. David, in that situation, if you guys left David in this in, in in that, let me know. I could not do it. Shepard, we got a break. I intercepted a distress call from a Torian patrol. They stumbled onto a collector ship beyond the Corliss system. The Torians were wiped out, but not before they crippled the collector vessel. I need you to board that ship and get some hard data on the collectors. Find us a way to get to their home world. I thought he was gonna rip into us for the Overlord DLC. Hard to imagine how a Torian patrol could take out a collector ship. Reports indicate the hull's intact, but all systems seem to be offline. They could be making repairs as we speak. I'm not saying it won't be dangerous, but we can't let an opportunity like this slip by. If they had a patrol out there, why aren't the Turians sending a recon team in? They will, eventually. But I intercepted the transmissions. In the meantime, we're feeding them false reports. You're close enough that you can be in and out before the Turians learn the truth. Are you sure this information is good? Information is my weapon, Shepard. It's good. Send me the coordinates and I'll take care of it. Already sent. Once you're aboard the ship, establish an uplink with Edie. She'll mine their data for information regarding the Omega-4 relay. Good luck, Shepard. Coordinates punched in. Let's go find us a collector ship. Good. Well, apparently... We're just great going into a collector ship. I, uh, I have so much stuff left to do. I feel like this is way too early. We have a visual on the collector ship, Commander. Very low emissions. Passive infrared temperatures suggest most systems are offline. Thrusters are cold. That thing is massive. How the hell did the Turians take it out? Super unforgiving. Okay. Radar scans do not detect any halt. I hope I have enough time to uh, 
Do all the other missions. Mass effect field distortions. It appears the drive core is offline. Rendezvous in 30 seconds, Commander. Good luck. Never seen a ship like this before. Somewhat resembles an insect hive. Penetrating scans have detected an access node to uplink with collector data banks. Marking location to your hard suit computer. Um, this must be what uh, Brainplate was talking about. She said when she was playing that she thought she was screwed because. Oh, damn. Maybe the defense tower softened it for the Turians. Perhaps the missing colonists are there, if they're still alive. Or it's a trap. Same containers as on Horizon, only empty. It must have been horrible, trapped in these pods, helpless. Completely at the mercy of the collectors. It sounded like a horror game up in here. What happened here? Why would the collectors just leave a pile of bodies lying around? Test subjects from control group. Discarded after experiment was over. There are worse things than death, like being a test subject for twisted aliens. This was wrong. Inhumane. Even if collectors needed to kill for experiments, could have ended lives painlessly. I know you're right, but it doesn't make me feel any better. I uh, agree with you guys. I'm gonna go with all this dynamic. What the heck is going on? Collector, were they experimenting on one of their own? Edie, I'm uploading the data from this terminal. See if you can figure out what they were up to. Data received. Analyzing. The collectors were running baseline genetic comparisons between their species and humanity. Are they looking for similarities? I have no hypothesis on their motivations. All I have are the preliminary results. And one that is structure identical to traces collected from ancient ruins. Yeah. Only one race is known to have this structure, the Protheans. My god. The Protheans didn't vanish. They're just working for the Reapers now. These are no longer Prothean Shepherd. Their genes show distinct signs of extensive genetic rewrite. The Reapers have repurposed them to suit their needs. You'd think somebody would have picked up on this. No one has had an opportunity to study a collector genetic code in this detail. I've already matched 2,000 alleles to recorded fragments. This collector likely descends from a Prothean colony in the Styx Theta Cluster, but there are signs of extreme alteration. Three fewer chromosomes, reduced heterochromatin structure, elimination of superfluous junk sequences. The 
the Reapers didn't wipe out the Protheans. They turned them into monsters and enslaved them. Still, they're working for the Reapers now, and we have to stop them. No species should have to suffer through that. Let's find what we need before the Collectors come to salvage this vessel. Move out. Oh, do we get to pick a certain gun? Why? Why can't we just take arms? We get a new sniper rifle because our, our other sniper rifle sucks. And I definitely feel like we could just reach down and grab these other ones, but... What do I know? I'm sure Garrus will appreciate the new sniper rifle too. Look, on the ceiling, more of those strange parts. Hundreds at least. Wonder how many are full. Too many. I detect no signs of life in the pod, Shepard. It is probable the victims inside died when the ship lost primary power. That's messed up. Entire thing is messed up. This is valuable. I will definitely take that. you on this one, uh, Joker. This 100% feels like a trap. I don't know if this is the elusive man setting us up for something again, or, or what, but this is perhaps central. and uh Orton have a lot to say about this sure that other companions do too but there on the platform looks like some kind of control panel lack of collectors seems odd alive or dead suggest caution Edie I'm setting up a bridge between you and the collector ship see if you can get anything useful from the databanks Gonna hijack our ship. Data mine in progress, Shepard. Uh, that can't be good. What the hell just happened? Major power surge. Everything went dark, but we're back up now. I managed to divert the majority of the overload to non-critical systems. Shepard, it was not a malfunction. This was a trap. Not good. Not good at all. Then you better get it done fast. Where's this? Come on, sniper. We've got incoming hostile. Trouble ahead. 
Ooh, this new sniper rifle does some more damage. But they're a little too close to use it, so. Focus on Shepard. Well, of course Harbinger would show up. Come on, Edie. Speed it up. The forces of the universe bend to me. Oh, oh, oh my goodness. Rain was not joking. This is super unforgiving. This hurts you. Get back in cover. For your genetic destiny. We are getting wrecked, holy crap. Oh my poor crew. Oh that did not sound good, Tally. Go with me? Freaking husk up there, or whatever this thing is, Scion. Oh, Orton's down. Dude, they go through our shields so fast, it's ridiculous. Oh my gosh. Carpenter is back. That's that's fun. You love to see it. Watch out, Tally! They're coming right up on you. Just not mess around. Us. Holy crap. Okay, can we can we can we move up? Possibly. Shepard, you must manually reestablish my link to the command console. Alright, we were we were a little busy. Trying to stay alive. We're gonna have to freaking go through waves of more enemies now. Regained control of the platform, Shepard. I knew you wouldn't let us down, Edie. I always work at optimal capacity. Did you get what we needed? I found data that would help us successfully navigate the Omega 4 relay. I have also found a Turian distress call that served as the lure for this trap. The collector's rich source. It is unusual. What are you getting at? Turian emergency channels have secondary encryption. It is present, but corrupted in the message. It is not possible that the elusive man would believe the distress call was genuine. What a dick. so sure? I found the anomaly with Cerberus detection protocols. He wrote them. He knew it was a trap? Why would he send us into a trap? That son of a bitch sent us right into collector hands. We should have known this would happen. Cerberus can't be trusted. Uh, Commander, we got another problem. The collector ship is powering up. Of course it is. I do not have full control of their systems. I will do what I can. Sending coordinates for shuttle extraction. Come on, let's move. We just running back, I'm assuming. Run. Run with everything you've got. Oh, 
armor. Right, you got it. I'm just waiting for a bunch of freaking collectors to pop out. Weapons ready. Yep. Of course. Dude, they do so much damage. It's insane. <laughs> Harbinger, go away. We have our hands full. Oh my goodness. Push to a faster gun. They do so much damage, even with all those freaking damage upgrades. Oh my goodness. This is absolutely insane. You're a dick. Assuming control. They should soften them up. We do not die. Neutralize. Uh, help, guys. Please help. Please help. Hey, when you're behind cover and they just rip into you. Trouble to the right. No. Get wrecked, Harbinger. Get wrecked. And this is this is ridiculous, man. Apparently, he was not dead. So many of them, holy crap. Of course you are. Honestly, I feel- Oh, there's- What the fuck are those? Oh, rip more you. I'm trying to kill everyone else so he doesn't have any forms to take control of. This hurts you. They are bacteria. Oh my goodness. Yes, I will take more heavy weapon ammo. Updates, ED. Anything? This is a this is a hard mission, guys. Goodness gracious. Holy crap. Is this where we're supposed to go? Yeah, okay. Can we just What the fuck? 
another one of these things? Good God. Dude, these Praetorians are awful. Target was immune. Problematic. Oh my, oh my goodness. Come on, squad. Morton's dead again. He takes so much. So much. Oh, he's coming up here. I don't. That's not good. That's not good. Dude, they just fucking keep coming. Um, can we run? I don't know if we can just run. Dude, what? What? What am I supposed to do? we can fight this thing. I don't know if I have to or not. It just, it, it's barriers keep coming back. I don't... I don't know if we can kill it. Run, run, run. run. Oh, it right closed the door. That's I, I don't I don't know what to do. This thing is ridiculous. Stop! Stop healing yourself, please, for the love of everything good and holy. We, we can't get through it. We will literally every time. Oh, would you look at that? It gets his barrier back again. I am opening a door on the far side of the room. Yeah, you you, you do that, dude. Taking fire. I'm ridiculous. Anyone that played this on Insanity, I'm, I'm sure you're like medically diagnosed with something now. I, I can't even begin to imagine. This is the most ridiculous thing I've ever done. It's, 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 it's pretty ridiculous, Rain. Pretty... Pretty ridiculous. just got yeeted. I'm doing my best, Tyler. Come 
on guys, keep shooting, I need you to do it while I'm drawing all the fire. This is fun. This is so much fun. I am opening a door on the far side of the room. Bruh, fuck off. Be great. Yeah, I keep telling him to use it, but right. come on, game. that more than like dies every few seconds. Bro, why why are you just spamming your I'm sure you guys are just like one bar. Why are you just sitting there? But I was like stuck in an animation, like you would not stop trying to go back into the crouch. This is this is ridiculous. I want to punch the elusive man in the dick. Oh, mates, for the love of God, do something. Insane. He's gonna trap me up here. You're good, Rain. I'll figure it out. Every time I wake into his armor. Every time. Working on the tally. Stupid little thing. Oh, 
been around for it. Get wrecked, 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 get wrecked,
Mission is ridiculous. How oh, ridiculous. Commander, I hate to rush you, but those weapons are about to come online. I'm sure they are, buddy. It, it, it won't let me rain. It, literally, I tried. Okay, I've checked multiple times. It, it won't let me. There's so many fucking husk. But you think you're super clever with your no cursing commands, Rain? My controller will not stop vibrating. I don't know what's going on. I don't like it. We're out of time, Commander. We have to go. You heard the man. Everybody onto the Normandy. Move. Strap in, people. I'm gonna make them work for it this time. Come on, Joker, you can do it. Anywhere. Anywhere that's not here. Engage Mass Effect Core. Oh my goodness. Seriously, can can, can I punch the elusive man in the dick? Shepard, looks like Edie extracted some interesting data before the collector ship came back online. Edie told us the distress call originated from the collectors. You betrayed us, just like I knew you would. We're at war. The collectors are taking humans, and every minute we waste is one more we give the enemy to prepare. I know the stakes, but we're supposed to be on the same side, and I can't trust you. Without that information, we don't reach the Collector homeworld, and you and every other human may as well be dead. It was a trap, but I was confident in your abilities. And don't forget Edie. The Collectors couldn't have anticipated her. Here's an idea. Hey, Shepard. The Collectors are laying a trap for you. I just thought you should know. You could have told me the plan. You say I'm important, but you sure try hard to get me killed. I needed the Collectors to believe they had the upper hand. Telling you could have tipped them off in any number of ways. Besides, I wouldn't have sent you in if I didn't think you could succeed. You have one job. Information. If I can't trust your intel, you're useless to me. It's never that simple. You of all people should know well, that. I know that I'll be a lot more careful. With the Collectors, and with you. This is no time for petty grudges. 
Things are about to get a lot tougher. Edie confirmed our suspicions. The Reapers and Collector ships use an advanced identify friend foe system that the relays recognize. All we need to do is get our hands on one of those IFFs. I was just on the Collector ship. Why didn't you say anything about finding their IFF? As I said, Edie just confirmed it. Besides, you wouldn't have had time to find and extract it, but we have options. An Alliance science team recently determined that the Great Rift on the planet Clendigan is actually an impact crater from a mass accelerator weapon. A very old mass accelerator. I sent a team to find either the weapon or its target. They found both. The weapon was defunct, but it helped us plot the flight path of the intended target. A 37 million year old derelict reaper. We found it damaged and trapped in the gravity of a brown dwarf. Aren't brown dwarves basically stars that didn't quite make it? Simply put, but accurate. They're gas giants that don't quite have the masses of stars. Expect gale force winds and extremely high temperatures. The Reaper has a mass effect field that keeps it in orbit, likely an automated response to the external threats. It's stable, but I won't call it safe. I saw what Sovereign did to the Citadel fleet. Hard to imagine anything could stop something that powerful. This vessel is a relic from a battle waged while mammals took their first steps on Earth. There's no trace of the species that took the shot. Perhaps it was their one moment of defiance before being wiped out. I only believe you because I doubt you'd repeat yourself so soon. It's no less a risk, Shepard. We lost contact with Dr. Chandana's team shortly after they boarded. Initial reconnaissance revealed no clues, and it was too risky to commit more resources. But now we need that IFF. I'll forward the coordinates to Joker. In the meantime, I suggest you tell your crew I didn't risk their lives unnecessarily. It will make things easier going forward. Edie, tell the crew to assemble. We've got a lot to talk about. Of course, Shepard. Uh, I probably still would have gone if I would have known what I was walking into. Ooh, that sounds cool. I'm gonna punch that dude in the face. So the elusive man didn't sell us out. Could have fooled me. Lied to us. Used us. Needed access to the Collector databanks. Necessary risk. He tries something like that again and the Collectors will be the least of his problems. Edie, are you sure this IFF is gonna work? My analysis is accurate, Shepard. I have also determined the approximate location of the Collector homeworld based on navigational data from their vessel. That can't be right. Better run the diagnostics, Joker. Looks like our AI's got a bug in the software. My calculations are correct. The Collector homeworld is located within the galactic core. Can't be. The core is just black holes and exploding suns. There are no habitable planets there. Could be an artificial construction, space station protected by powerful mass effect fields and radiation shields. Even the Collectors don't have that kind of technology. The Collectors are just servants of our real enemy, and we've all seen what their masters are capable of. They built the mass relays in the Citadel. Who's to say they can't build a space station surrounded by black holes? No wonder nobody's ever returned from a trip through the Omega-4 mass relay. The logical conclusion is that a small safe zone exists on the far side of the relay, a region where ships can survive. Standard relay transit protocols would not allow safe transport. Drift of several thousand kilometers is common, and would be fatal in the galactic core. The Reaper IFF must trigger the relay to use more advanced encrypted protocols. Just because we can follow the collectors through the relay doesn't mean we can take them out. I don't want to go after him until I know we're ready. Sooner or later, we need that IFF. I say, why wait? It's a derelict Reaper. What if the Collectors are waiting for us? We may want to build up our team before we take that kind of risk. Exactly. The more people we have on our side, the better our chances of success. We need to keep building up the team. It's your call, Commander. Whatever you decide, we're with you. That was the most ridiculous set of missions I've ever done. I went from borderline tears, seeing everything that they were doing to David. 
to wanting to just rack the freaking elusive man. Second thing I just thought about, pretty sure my fish are going to be dead. That sucks. Got kind of uh, locked into being off the ship for more than one mission. Commander, you received a new message at your private terminal. Oh, they're not dead. Praise be. Important request from Mr. Ganak El Hal. Mr. Sir and Madam, having consulted with my colleagues on the Citadel, I have the privilege of request for your assistance to transfer a large quantity of protein technology to Elos. Ilos. Believing these materials to be hazardous danger, they were locked in quarantine, even though the tests revealed that the fears were groundless. The quarantine remains in effect until one can pay for a permit to request a reclassification from the Culture Ministry. Knowing of your interest in producing technology, I would be happy to deliver most of it into your hands, keeping less than half for myself. As a Batarian, I cannot engage in council official activities. But if you transfer the 20,000 credits required to me, this exchange could be made in your name, enabling us both to perhaps from this happy accident. Sure, buddy. Sure. Argia facility update. Commander Shepard con contacting Perus Lucid Man's instructions. He believed you would want to know that he had ordered Subject Zero's project shut down before the riot broke out. Cerberus personnel will arrive to find all guards dead, along with most of the subjects. Any surviving children were treated for injuries, given mild amnesic treatments, and delivered to Alliance facilities as survivors of slavery attacks. A few surviving doctors were forced to be retired for their role in the project. For your report, the facility on Paragia has been destroyed. Dr. Archer's brother from Elusman. Shepard, I understand you've taken Dr. Archer's brother to Grissom Academy. Familiar with their work. It should be a good home for him. I don't condemn Dr. Archer's actions, but they did provide a breakthrough we've been sorely lacking this far. Likely another find another individual with David's unique talents, though your decision is understandable, it set us our efforts to understand the guest back several years. Oh That was ridiculous. Allie, will you talk to me? I need I need someone to to comfort me, please. Just hold me tightly. Ken, do you think we'll make it through this? Of course we will, Gabby. I mean, as long as we take down the collectors, it's all worth it. Even if we don't make it. Don't even think that. We'll make it through. Please. Shepard, oh. I'm glad you came by. I may need your help. Anything for I you, Bay. I just babe. received a message from the migrant fleet. The Admiralty Board has accused me of treason. I'm scared, Shepard. Nobody who knows you could believe you'd betray your people, Tally. I don't know. They don't lay charges like this unless the evidence seems absolute. But thanks. I appreciate your faith in me, Shepard. Is it because you're working with Cerberus? I'm not working with Cerberus. I'm working with you. And I got leave to serve on the Normandy again. I have no idea what they're accusing me of. You think I would remember if I betrayed the fleet? What happens when a Quarian is accused of treason? There's a hearing, with members of the Admiralty Board acting as judges. My father is an Admiral on the board. He'll have to recuse himself from judgment. I can't even imagine what he's thinking right now. The punishment for treason is exile. If they convict me, I can never go back. So you have no idea why they're accusing you? None. The specifics of charges like this are rarely discussed on open channels. I won't know any more until I get to the flotilla. What happens if you're convicted? Like I said, exile. The specifics are up to the judges. If it's deemed only a tragic mistake in judgment, the guilty party might receive a small ship and supplies. Not that it really matters. Either way, if I'm convicted, I'll never see the migrant fleet again. So no prison and no death penalty? We don't have the spare resources for long-term incarceration. Monitored work detail is more effective. And we don't have enough people to afford executions. 
In exile can still have children, and those children are welcomed back to the fleet. How often is someone from the fleet charged with treason? It's rare. It must be something that affects the entire flotilla, not just one ship. The most recent one was Anora Vanya Vasilani, an engineer who handed over fleet defense schematics to the Batarians. Yeah, that seems pretty bad. She had good intentions. The Batarians were contracted to upgrade our systems, but they passed the defense schematics to a pirate gang. Was she convicted? No. She made a suicide run on the pirate gang. She destroyed them before they could attack the fleet. She was pardoned posthumously. Let's hope I don't have to prove my innocence. That's that that's way. that's that's shitty. So how does the trial work? How soon do we need to get you there? They'll wait a reasonable period of time for me to come and defend myself. Eventually, if I don't show up, they'll try me in absentia. As for how it works, it's less formal than an Earth trial or something you'd see on the Citadel. We are a family. This is just the worst kind of family meeting. Okay. Let's go find the flotilla. I was going to book passage on another ship. I didn't think there would be time for you to help. Thank you, Shepard. I'll program the Normandy with the flotilla's current location. The admirals will be waiting for us. Retali. Oof. Okay. That was... An eventful three hours. We helped Jack get her revenge slash closure. We had to deal with the awful project overload. Overlord. And then all that nonsense at the collector ship. But it's been three hours. I had a long day at work and I have another long day of work ahead of me tomorrow. Thank you so much to everyone that tuned tonight. I do greatly, greatly appreciate it again. Um, as always, once again, sorry for the uh, weird mic angle or um, camera angle and uh, the mic quality. Um, get into the start of the stream to figure out everything that happened with that. But uh, thank you for bearing with it. Thank you so much to everyone that tuned again. If you're watching on YouTube, hit that thumbs up, subscribe, come chat with us all. That fun stuff. Just another reminder, like I said, we're off all weekend, anniversary, and uh, parents are visiting. So I will see you guys, or Rain will see you guys uh, on Monday. Thanks again. Hope you all have a great rest of your night and or day whenever you're choosing to watch this. And until next time, everyone, stay safe. Stay out of trouble. I'm not going to do that. Don't get hot. Peace out, everybody.